really love it here and I couldn't imagine living anywhere else. Kind of like Moss, Seattle has grown on Maria Semple, but it was hardly love at first sight. Oh, this is After 15 years of writing for shows like Arrested Development and Mad About You, Maria, her boyfriend and daughter left LA for Seattle in 2008. I felt like I had no career and I had no friends and I didn't really fit in. And so uh, the easiest uh, and most convenient scapegoat seemed to be Seattle. Miserable, Maria poured out pages of anti-Seattle rants. There are two hairstyles here, short gray hair and long gray hair. The result is what makes Where'd You Go Bernadette such a fun read. Samuel Beckett once said there's nothing funnier than unhappiness and that was my credo as I wrote this book. First off, whoever laid out this city never met a four-way intersection. They didn't turn into a five-way intersection. The drivers here are horrible. And by horrible, I mean they don't realize I have someplace to be. They're the slowest drivers you ever saw. It's like a hypnotist put everyone from Seattle in a collective trance. You are getting sleepy. When you wake up, you will want to live only in a craftsman house. The year won't matter to you. All that will matter is that the walls will be thick, the windows tiny, the rooms dark, the ceilings low, and it will be poorly situated on the lot. Sorry. Maria has made lots of friends in Seattle, including actor Tom Skerritt, who appears in a promotional video Maria made for the book. How's this for a pitch for my novel? Where'd You Go Bernadette is an epistolary novel narrated by a 14-year-old girl about her misanthropic mother, Bernadette. Epistolary novel? Well, I certainly wouldn't buy an epistolary novel. <laughs> Ken Jennings, would you like to read my novel? No, I'm good. With great word of mouth, including an enthusiastic blurb from Pulitzer Prize finalist Jonathan Franzen, Maria's publishers figured Bernadette might sell. Nobody knew the book would sell out. It is the top selling book in our store, bar none. The old Maria might have raced right back to Hollywood, but the Seattle version isn't phased a bit. Seattle is very cool. It's very hard to impress Seattle. And yet it seems that you have. Perhaps, we'll see. That, that, then that really would be uh, quite a feather in my cap if I was able to. <laughs> to impress this, this very cool town.